Hey everybody, I'm Amy from Body Fit by Amy and this is your EMOM cardio workout. This is day 26 of your holiday hit challenge. This is a fast paced cardio workout in the EMOM format. That means every minute on the minute. You will have a few different moves for a certain number of reps. When you finish those reps, you rest for the rest of the minute and then you jump right in on the minute. It moves quickly, but you go at your own pace. The goal is just to get moving and get our hearts pumping. Are you ready? Let's do it. Okay, so let's start with a little march or a jog, whatever feels better for you. Let's get some rolls of the shoulders. We are gonna keep this warm up pretty short so we can keep this workout short. So of course, if you need more of a warm up or a cool down, get it on your own. You can check out my extended warm up, five minute warm up if you wanna add on, and my extended 10 minute cool down videos. Those are great options to add on to the warm up for the cool down. Big deep breath in and out. One more, breathe and out. Let's open up those arms with some swings. Stretch out, open the chest and take it side to side, opening the hips in that side lunge. So EMOM, every minute on the minute. So you go at your own pace. It is cardio, so you can go quick if that works for you, big arm swings. And as I said, three exercises that we will have eight reps. The last exercise in each circuit will be one where we have a right side or a left side, so it will go a little quicker. We have these loosely divided in a lower body cardio, then an upper body, and then a core. Our first three rounds are all standing, except for a burpee with some modifications. Go ahead and let you know that it's coming. And then our last round is all on the mat. So that way, there's not a ton of up and down in between. You can get through things and transition quickly. So eight reps of each, you are on your own count. If you don't feel like counting and you just wanna stay with me and transition when I transition, that's totally fine. Again, how quickly you get through the EMOM is how much rest you actually get. So if you get through it in 40 seconds, you'll have 20 seconds of rest, 50 seconds, 10 seconds of rest. So if you find you're not getting through it quickly, but you still need that rest, just take it. It is totally fine. It is all about going at your own pace. As I always say, be where you are today. I want you to challenge yourself and EMOM is definitely a format that can be pretty challenging, but in a way that works for you. So if you need more rest, take it. If you need to do less reps, take it. It is all your workout, right? So stretch it out. I'm gonna get you just moving while I talk you through your first round. Again, four rounds, four minutes each. So four minutes that we will do every minute on the minute. Let's take it back to those hamstring curls. Just keep it moving, you can jump it if you want. I will give you low impact and high impact options, as well as other modifications if you need them. And we will get one minute in between to grab some water, get a rest. You can keep moving if you want to, but you probably will need that rest. That's where I'll explain our next three moves. Okay, you stay here with the hamstring curl. Watch me here, our first, three moves in our first four minute circuit. We're gonna alternate our lunges. So down is one, two, you can step it, you can tap it if that feels better, you can jump it, right? So any of those options, eight lunges. Then we're gonna go one jack, one jab. So jack, jab is one, jack, jab is two. Low impact, just step it out and punch. Then we're doing knee raises, eight on the right for our core, Eight on the right for our core, eight on the left. All right, are we ready? Breathe for just a second. We got four minutes. You're starting over every minute on the minute. Here we go. So lunge. You don't have to stay with me. You can be faster or slower, whatever is good for you. When you get to eight, whether you're jumping or just lunging or tapping, then you move on up. 
Light on those toes either way. Whip that jack. Low impact, it's just a step. Strong, full range of motion, then knee raises. Up, you can go slow or fast, you can jump or not jump. Moving to the other side. Strong, think about the core being engaged. Four, good. All right, I got 15 seconds to breathe. Maybe you're finishing, maybe you've been finished for a while. We're gonna start back on that minute. In five, four, can you get through a little quicker this time? Two, one, here we go. Again, if you're jumping. Yes, burn. Good, jack and jab. Strong with your arms is what I want on the jack and the jab because it's all cardio, but this is our upper body. Breathe. Yes, and then our knee raises. And then eight other side knee raises. Yes, good. I was about the same. I'm just gonna try to go a little bit faster this time if I can. Two minutes almost down, two to go. So catch your breath. When you finish your eight, eight, and eight, and eight. <laughs> Starting in three, two, one. Here we go, lunge it. Don't sacrifice form to go quicker. I still want you to get low and be precise, right? Out, punch forward, out, punch forward. Yes, good knees. Pull them strong, core engaged. Other side. Keep it going, finish it out. I was a tiny bit faster that time. All right, we're down to our last minute. Can you go a little quicker while keeping your good form? Try it, see how it goes. If you need to go slower, go slower. If you don't wanna count, just switch when I switch. Last minute to go, catch your breath. Here we go. Push yourself because we got that one minute break coming. Yes, jack and jab. Yes, keep that strong punch. Full range of motion. Yes, knees. Think about that core. You're not just hopping, you're really pulling the core in. Yes. All right, finish out that minute, breathe. Hopefully your heart rate got up. That was our little warm up round, right? <laughs> you still got 10 seconds to finish. Wherever you are, be where you are today. You showed up, you're successful. Nice work team. All right, everybody grab a quick sip. Tap it out or jog it out. If you really just wanna keep going, just pick one of those cardio moves we just did, jack and jab, lunge, or knee raise, and keep with it. Otherwise, 45 seconds to breathe, watch me. We're going with our regular squat. So drop it down, bring it up. If you can, up on the toes. If you want, squat jump, nice and light. Next, we have our in and out jack. So we're going up, out, strong arms, again, with, tap outs instead of jumps if you want. Then we've got side knees, pulling it up, eight, pulling it up for eight. You can jump it if you want it, you can grab the wall. If you need extra balance, it's up to you. So squat or squat jumps, in and out jacks, up and out jacks, side knees. Are we ready? Here we go. For eight, everything's on the eight. Jump it or squat it. Nice and light landing, still getting low, even if you're jumping. Up and out jacks. This is two, three. Sorry, I forgot to tell you. 
Each one up and out counts. Oh, I think I lost my count. Oh well, here we go. Side knee for eight. Really think about pulling in the obliques so you get that side crunch. Other side, if you're with me. Yes, breathe. Keep going if you're still going. Finish it out every minute on the minute. We're gonna do that all again in five, four, three, two. Start with your squat. Up on the toes or jump, but either way, make sure you're still getting low. Slower or faster than me, doesn't matter. Good. We're going one, two, three, four. Yes. Definitely did too many last time, right? Side knees. Good. Other side. Get set up. Three, two, one. Huh. Went by quicker that time for me, I guess, because I didn't do as many jacks. All right. 10 seconds to finish it out or 10 seconds to breathe. Doing it all again, guys. This one's gonna go by quick. I know it's gonna feel repetitive in the moment, but we're gonna get it done fast. Here we go. Next minute. Low to high, power from the legs. Up and out jacks, strong arms. And out. Yes. Side knees, really get that strong crunch. Keep it going. Other side, get set up. Here we go. Yes. Keep going if you're still going. Breathe if you want that breather. We got 10 seconds to go. All right, guys, how can you make it different this time? If you want to take those toes out, plie squat jump, go for it. Ready, here we go. Down and up, or jumps for eight. You got it. Finish it strong. Can you get quicker? Up and out jacks. Yes. Side knees, finish it out. Last one. Pull it in. Little jump if you can. Take it here. Good. Four, three, two, one. If you're done, tap it out with me here. <laughs> if you're not, keep it moving till you're done. You got 10 seconds to finish it out. Then we get another one minute break. So push through, do what you gotta do. Three, two, one. You made it another four minute round. Grab us of water. It's quick guys, for a lot of us, it's probably feeling similar to another cardio where we do 40 or 45 seconds of work, followed by 15 or 20 seconds of rest. For a lot of us, it's probably straight through. Some of you, it might be 30, 30. You do you. You got 40 seconds, watch me here. You can keep it going with some jacks or whatever you want. All right, skater. This is one, two, three. So you gotta go both sides. You got your skater. You can tap it out or you can jump it. Then you have the option to go just down and up or full burpee, but all we got is four. If you're going down and up, I want you to get eight, all right? And then we're going across knee for eight, across knee for eight. Are you ready? You can do it. Here we go, skater. That's one. Get low. Little more legs into that hip. Four, three, or wherever you are. Burpees or touchdowns. You only got four. Breathe. 
Bring it up. Two. Last one. Ha. Cross knee. Here we go. Eight. Jump it or step it. Four. Three. Two. One. Other side. Ha. This is going to be the hard one, right? Yes. Four. Three. Two. Three. If you got it. Otherwise, finish them out. Ha. Right? Those burpees are going to get you. So. Do what's best for you. Ready. Here we go. Next minute. Skaters. You decide if you want more rest at the end or more rest during it. As in going a little slower. It might work differently for everybody. Breathe. Up and down. Remember, you can also just pop it back or walk it back. And then cross it. Here we go. Really focus on getting that opposite elbow towards the knee. Two hands or one. Four, three, two, one. Two rounds, guys. You got 10 seconds to finish that second round. Wherever you are, it doesn't matter. Be where you are. Ponytail's falling down. Here we go. Skater. Can you get a little quicker, a little lower? Keep it going. Yes. Stay with me. Burpees. Burpees are not for everybody. So if you're here, just keep it here. But just make sure you're getting a few more. Breathe. Yes. Pull it across. So close. Right here. Yes. All right, team. 10 seconds to finish this round. And they got one more minute. It's blowing by, I hope. I know it's tough. But you got it. Skaters, last time. Here we go. Little quicker. Little lower. Show me what you've got. Four. Three. Two. Burpees. Finish it out. Only four or eight up top. Full range of motion. Don't cheat it. Last one. <laughs> Take it across. Eight. Whew. Yes. Other side. Good. Yes. You did it. You got 10 seconds to finish wherever you are. Ooh, my hair is up. <sighs> right? One minute to breathe, guys. Keep it going. Whoo! Tap it. Everything this last round is on the mat. I'm gonna give you options. So if you need to keep it standing, you just pick some of the moves that we just did. All right, team. You keep moving. Watch me. We got our plank press. Stay on your knees if you need to, pre-post DR. Down, down, up, up. Down, down, up, up, or here. This is one, all the way up, two, just like that. Then we take it to our Superman. Modification is that bird dog. One, two, everybody else. One, two, lift it up. Then we're back to here. We're actually gonna go eight here, and then eight cross. So one, two, or one, two, if you're tapping it. Are we ready? Here we go, take it down. Down, down, up, up. Right, left, right, left. Left, right, left, right. Keep it going. Wherever you are, take it, Superman. 
eight, seven. You don't have to stay with me. Up, up. Then your mountain climbers, you got eight and eight. So run it or tap it. Modification, you're just tapping back, tapping back or standing mountain climber. Take it across. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, breathe. Awesome guys, if you want another modification, you can do your mountain climber here, mountain climber here, right? Woo, finish it out, 10 seconds. Whatever you got, I'm gonna adjust my fan to get some air down here. Ready, here we go, on the minute. Down, down, up, up. Hips are square, keep everything pulled in. Four more, if you're with me. Yes. Right, bird dog or superman, reach. And here, lengthen through your back. We're all the way down, four, three, two, one. Mountain climber, take it, one, two, three. We're running it. Across, two, three, four. Ah, 10 seconds to finish it out. Good guys, we're staying down for two more minutes. Be where you are, ready, minute, here we go. Down, down, up, up. Or you can be here. Just keep the core engaged. Use the arms, chest, and tries, but also really recruit those abs. It's all abs, right? Superman, lift, squeeze. Make sure you're taking this with good form. It's controlled, we're not gonna rush it. Three, two, arms and legs off the ground is all we need. Pop it up, eight, yes. Keep it up, take it across. Uh, one more round, guys. Whew. One more minute and we are done here. Can we finish it out? Here we go. Down and up at your own pace. But can you beat your pace the last time with these eight? Breathe. Keep those hips square. Pull up in the center. Yes. Superman controlled. Up and down. So you're not flopping around or pulling your back. Good form. Squeeze all the way through. Yes, finish it out mountain climbers. Whatever you got, tap or run it. Yes. Then cross it. Breathe, ah. three, two, one. Relax, short and sweet guys. No bonus move, kind of all feels like a bonus move, right? As quickly as we're moving. Ah. I want you to sit back, child's pose, get a stretch. Whew. Keeping it short today. Let me know in the comments if you liked this format. Kind of similar to the AMRAP, it's very dependent, roll through your back, cat's a cow, on you going at your own pace. So for some people, it might feel too fast. For some, it might be feel too slow. So let me know if you wanna see more workouts like this with weights, with equipment, body weight, or cardio all the way up. It's a fun format. The reason I've kind of shied away from it, haven't done much of it, is because you guys know I want you to have good form over anything else. Stretch those arms to the back. So I always worry we're gonna sacrifice form, but not you guys, right? You're gonna have good form all the way through, even if we're trying to go quickly, right? So keep that in mind for these EMOMs, for these AMRAPs, but really for all of your workouts. Quality over 
quantity. Let's get a little hamstring stretch here. Make sure that you like this video, that you subscribe to my channel. When you subscribe, it helps me be able to keep making completely free workouts here for you. Turn on those not notifications, click that little bell. You'll always know when a new workout comes out. It's a few times a week. And when I have a live workout coming up or new monthly challenges. And speaking of challenges, of course, check out the links in the description below. Get information on my Body Fit Athletic Club. It's a really fun group. We have a nutrition plan. We have monthly workout calendars, weekly workout calendars. And you have guidance and support from me, from Vivian, our Body Fit Dietitian, and from other body fitters. You can also just check out below on my website for my eBooks, programs, nutrition guide, and apparel. Whoo! Breathe. Thank you for showing up and moving with me today. I hope you had fun with that. Whew. You are strong. You are fit. One big deep breath in and out. You did it. That was your EMOM cardio workout. Great job, everybody.